All right, one for the good old XRP Army here, uh, requested by Mr. Justin Young, and he is looking for a four daily and weekly. Well, first off, the weekly higher term time frame is looking pretty damn good. We've already kind of retested the prior range highs, and thus, and so far, so good. Now, I wouldn't necessarily be looking for this one to have a bit of a resolution this week, but very likely next week or end of basically end of August. Currently uh, recording this on the 18th of August right now, so probably around you know probably around next week or or, or maybe last week. Uh, I would be looking for a retest of the highs on this rally, actually, somewhere around about one, uh, 160 or so, and very likely new highs on top of that. I'm just curious what the monthly looks like. Still maintaining the uptrend. We still have higher lows right here. We have higher highs above this high right here, so good, although that will take some time, maybe over the next few months, to uh, to evolve. Looking at it daily, uh, this one's actually rather okay. Uh, I, I know that this is kind of interesting to say about XRP, to be fair, but you know you do have a golden cross right here. All major moving averages are with positive slope, and they are all chasing right now too. And it looks like you're going to try to put in a higher low right around the 10 symbol. So now we can go into the short term time frame, see what we got going on over here. Full hour putting in another higher low on the 55. That is good. Hidden bullish evidence is going to be confirmed at the end of the next hour, 43 minutes and 49 seconds, with any sort of a closure basically above about 112 or so. And I would be looking at a short term target back up towards, you know, 119 and a half to 120. And this one probably trades sideways from there and then very likely uh, trades the upside over the next few weeks if that if that were to happen. Now, if we do actually come back down and uh, close a four hour total back down and below about one, 107 or so, then I would be looking for this one to have a pullback first to about 94 and a half. I'm not necessarily leaning towards that, though. The daily is actually one of the more stronger altcoin charts we've seen uh, today. So for what it's worth, I do want to check out over here what we can see on the momentum charts. Just see if that is coming in confluence with anything else that we're looking at right now. I guess we go to buy, buy derp for this one. Uh, four hour stokes going to turn up with any sort of a closure above 114. Not bad. Uh, let's see what daily looks like. Daily will turn up above uh, 128. So I don't, I don't think this one's like trending today or anything like that. I think it still trades more or less sideways in a short term time frame range. And weekly is up as long as above about 56 cents. So that is good for the long term. Uh, so yeah, you know, actually rather simple chart in this case. So hopefully that was helpful, sir. And what else do we have right here? Do we have anything on the four hour to be aware of as well? No, I think I think that's about it. I think it's about it. Uh, nice little range between about one, one, 110 and about uh, 130 or so. Anyways, hope that was helpful, sir.